always measure the amount of work you need to do and the amount of beers it takes to get done. What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Long delay, we'll talk about that later. It is life. Either way, as you can see, we have the Nova here for you again in Billie Jean's garage because Jean. <laughs> you can see the... Yeah, we got, we got all kinds of room. There, there's more room, yes? Yeah. And as you guys can see right here, if you'll show the kind of folks, we got ourselves a little, little upgrade. Now you guys may remember, we did the disc brake conversion on the fronts, which fantastic, kit was great, it was good installing, but this master cylinder is ancient and yeah, she, don't have power brakes, nothing. That distribution block is for drum up front, drum in the back. She's so we're gonna be swapping that out for disc up front, drum in the back, because we'll do, we'll do this. This little thing is gonna do wonders, apparently. So we're gonna do that. Miko. That's a better split. Yep, welcome, welcome Mickey's in the channel as well. Yeah. So what we need to do here, we're gonna jack up the rear. Um, we're gonna get that going and then start running lines. We're gonna do all these lines. So. This, this front's been replaced. We're gonna do that front, but we're gonna start with the rears. We're gonna jack up the rear, tear all the line out, put in the master, mock everything up. Then we gotta run and go get some fittings. We'll see if this works. Let's do it. And just so you know, the reason why we were delayed on everything was life happened, um, work. I was busy nonstop with clients, with real estate and Cameron, I just work 24 thing, seven, 24 seven, seven week, 365. So we sincerely apologize. Appreciate you guys sticking with us and we are gonna keep bringing you content. We're gonna really devote ourselves to this. So let's get to it now. Another thing we, I did to this morning, putting 93 in this thing. It's always ran 110 race gas for the compression on it, but that stuff's a, what is that called, inflation? Is that kind of what that is? <laughs> you think uh, my air suspension needs to be replaced yet? Probably. Oh yeah, there we go. Right all little, over the floor. A little nice up here. Oh, Don't mind none of that. That's that's all okay. over the floor, G. Oh, <laughs> We're super nice to each other around here. Yeah, save your floor because your wife is gonna love it when she sees that. It'll be fine. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Find out. So guys, after <laughs> Bailey cut the brake line, just he went under there and just went snip. I realized we uh we should have probably made sure that this unit. Uh, is gonna work. So, <laughs> oh, let's do uh, that. When you let's listen to stuff first. online, it just, they'll tell you, yeah, that works. Then you get it, you try it, and uh, it, it doesn't. Yeah, so, why don't we go ahead and do that first? Why don't we, why don't we take a gander up here real quick before we <laughs> all the way back there like you already did with the snippy snippies. <laughs> I'm in my filter now. Very nice filter. <clears throat> Brand new top. Actually, didn't mean to. <laughs> yeah, look, you, you dented the. Oh hell no, I didn't. I'm so guy. sorry, Gene. That's that uh -oh. right there's a K and N. She she not cheap. It's coming out. Oh, there's the rod. There's the rod. Look at that. Oh, got snagged on the. Goodness. Let's so that's the, the rod. Yep. So yeah, that is what we're talking about for right here. And then yeah, this boot. We'll pull this boot off. Side by side. Let's see here. Got the master off. I think we're gonna have to measure. I can't see inside there. It's a little, it honestly, it Here's looks. Here's what we do. You wanna measure? It looks deeper. Uh, oh. Here's your measuring stick. Let's take a gander. Right about you. Oh, it's pretty close. Let me see. It's pretty close, honestly. That's money. That's satisfactory. That's 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 good. We're golden, G. And that right there, friends. That's why we have electric tools. 2023. Keeps her nice and simple. Old school bracketry. Look at that. I'm definitely gonna hold on to that. I'm not a hoarder. Yeah, you are. <laughs> I am. The, everything has has a use, and you know. Not that. Like like that the wife. Will never have another use. Like the wife doesn't understand that it, this has a use somewhere. You, oh. you know it too. You're hey, a hoarder, hey. you're just as bad. Hold this. Y'all didn't even hear this mop got engaged. Yes, I did. This mop got engaged. You just said the white thing, I clicked. We didn't even tell the people. Nope. Mop's engaged. engaged. It was, it this was, man's it was went good. up to a mountain. Now, she has to support my addiction. <laughs> she can't leave, so. <laughs> All right, ladies and gentlemen, we're gonna dry fit this here. And shove the rod inside of it. Oh, I might have to hit the brake pedal in there or something. No, we don't want to. We don't want to hit the pedal at all. Very good, very good. That's perfect. Just slide on there. Really. Yeah. Make sure. Bolt her up, and it doesn't look like you're sliding on the back too far. 
Wall. Oh yeah, it is up against yeah. the wall. Wow, yeah. there's not enough. There's not much thread, is there? No. There's a little thread the... left. We'll get her on there. She, if she holds, yeah, that's perfect. Fifty percent, fifty percent. That's my average grade in high school. So, and then this here is the the drum to drum style. Um, if you guys can see that, I'm sorry about the lighting. Either way, so we're going from that to this style here, which is disc drum. If I spin it around the right way. We got the back entrance right here, front drivers, I believe, and then front passenger on the bottom here. And this will actually sit upright like this rather than sideways like this one. See this line right here? Yeah. You, so we just cut this. Yeah. Okay. So you guys are wondering the easiest way to tear out lines. You just. Yeah. Somebody please cut out that, that, uh, voice right there and use that on some oh demo. yeah it didn't watch watch the sensors yeah well gee she she went from hard to limp she a limp line though damn it's because of the spring stuff that's all you do right here she is getting old you just do this and you will... <clears throat> snip bye bye oh she rolled she's she done uh -oh. she's done for sounds like we're gonna have to do that line too I, I did it, but go ahead. I want your written consent right now that I have permission to cut this line. Permission granted. I'm gonna need two hands. Snap. Oh, All right, update, here's where we're at. All the brake lines are out of this thing. We got this new one here, new one that we did uh, when we were doing the, the brake there. We finally got this one out. We, we decided to cut that one. It went mean. Uh, also, peep the gloves. Peep the gloves. Oh, man. And These are extra coverage right everything here. Everything underneath this side, all the way up to the hose back there. I think for now, we're gonna leave the hose. We're gonna see if they, we're gonna see if we get the, we can get the hose for the back there. If we can't, then we're just gonna run the main line here all the way to the back of that hose. And then these lines were actually replaced at one point. So we can run them for the time being, I think. But as you can see. Whoop. Yeah, these lines, they look nice, so. 1970, there was way more line than just this. I don't know where it all, oh yeah, there's some in here. There's all this, I mean, it was all bad, so. You know, like we said though before, it was all like good, good metal you know like they used good stuff back then or whoever replaced them at one point which i believe the fronts and part to the back was replaced at one point i mean it's still still pretty solid it, it bends there we but go. Now there she it goes. Broke. like copper takes what probably double that at least copper copper pinches easily but as far as bending it's very very forgiving so that's yeah. what makes it really nice yeah, you'd have to heat it as like you bend it over and over and over again All for right. it to snap like that i mean that, if you but... like just like Bend, 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 yeah. Then again, from factory, I understood. They got all these yeah. mounting clips and stuff, so these, this thing is not moving. I'm impressed. So we need to get, we're gonna pull these off for, yep, for I got a when couple. we mount the new copper line and There's stuff. There's like 87 and three quarters of these on the vehicle. I, you know, obviously I guess usually, it does something. So. Usually I would just zip tie certify if I was doing it on like my car, but camera doesn't really have anywhere to zip tie on the Nova. So we're gonna have to do these these mounts to make them nice and solid. So Check let's get- the skirt get, of this unit. Yeah, let's get to that right now. Speaking of uh, the engagement, why don't you show the well, beautiful ring? Bam! Hello. Holy. Drinking beer. This goes here first. Yes. And it goes on this side? Yeah. That's how it goes in, you're sure? I'm pretty sure. On scale of one to sure. Four. <laughs> we'll take it. We'll take that. Eric, it went like this. Yeah, it must. Billy's back there trying to get that the fitting off. Just want to update you guys quick. We got this portioning valve put in here and everything. Front line, same exact uh, fitting, which is good. This one we got in here. This mount, this bracket that they sent is nice, but it like barely fit. And we kind of had to bend this line a little. And I'm assuming we're gonna have to bend this one too. That kind of, you know, feeds in like whoop whoop. Uh, either way though, the back fitting here, the big one for the back brakes, the back line is the same size as this one coming out of the master for the back so when we go to the store we're gonna pick up one of these we got to pick up one more size of this here whatever that may be we got another one that will will match up um and then other than that 
We're gonna rip off the back, try and find that T that's in the back there. So there's a little T intersection, try and save the back lines because they actually look like they were somewhat replaced within the last, I don't know, 25 years. Um, and they look really good though. So like I just said, if you guys want to see more about the Z, feel free to comment down below. Um, maybe oh, even- you little mother. <laughs> How's it going under here, man? <laughs> Oh man. Oh, I can't get this. <laughs> I'm gonna hey, give gee, this no a shot. No one cares about this who went through this. Shout out to A, the guy that said, what did he say? He said, none of that kraut and jap Shout out to you because and, uh, we're gonna Z listen to suck you. Ass. Easy to gap. We, <laughs> yeah. we heard you, we heard, we heard you. you. Cameron there it is. <laughs> Cameron showed me those comments. I didn't even see them and I, I died. So shout out to him, that's why we're giving you the people what they want, giving them the Nova. Yeah, I'm trying to get this oh, fitting. Atlanta. This thing is like, look at that, you see the, see the tear on that there. line right there? That's what I'm about to take my half inch one. impact to this thing. Keep pulling, keep pulling. And kind of right here. Yep, and then it ran up in, along then, the pinch well. Geez, I have English, sorry, illiterate over here. So yeah, there was a mount here, mount here. Had to go in here. Here, out. That's that's rust in the eye. Oh, oh, low, out oh, here. Good, low. Mount there. Right up top to the hose. Look at that, plenty. See, I told you. Nice. And then we'll cut it right about. We'll cut it up here just to be safe. We got G running some lines all the way down there, so they went somewhere. Whoop dee. Came up. up. Came up right here. Whoop dee. And then we're gonna have to go right here. Got our uh, fittings here. Bailey's holding on to the new line for the back because it had a little uh, little rub spot in it, which we'll have to figure out something so it doesn't do that next time. But either way, got a whole bunch of fittings here. They didn't have the packages for individuals like you needed, so it was $10, $10, $10. But I guess I'll have them for later. Got a little extra line. Still got this pre-made action we got to put in. Needed the, the sizing and all that good business. Um, but either way, here's the back that we got um it's pretty much universal with like old school c10s malibus nova chevelle impala whatever you want to really use so that works really well it was cool summit actually sent this as well with the the proportioning valve it just it states all the the sizes so if you guys are using this kit and for some reason you don't have this there you go if you can see it here's why we're getting rid of this bad unit honestly i'm surprised that thing I'm surprised that thing held in there for the time being. Oh my nanta. Three. So Ooh, we, we in. did leave you out a little bit. All these, yeah, we had to, we had just had to do this because this was too much. But you can see all these lines connected. Connected. We brought this one up. Uh, back here. We'll get you a little underneath look here. Give me one second. Good old Mako shout out. If they ever want to send us tools, let us know. Right here you can see we got that line ran we ran it all the way down there across and then we had to do a new line up going to that drum because it was absolutely worthless so got that cameron it's time filling to, up the i'm gonna worry about this this plugs in fluid. but it's not this we'll do that later. there's a new one so yeah i'm gonna worry about that like probably i don't know never we'll do it later don't you fret we're gonna make cameron Bleed. open up the bleeders I'm going to have the easy job of pumping, which is pump well breaks. earned after all the hard work all those lines were. Huh. All right, what did we just accomplish? <laughs> what did we just accomplish? Finish bleeding on the brakes. Bleeding on the brakes. What yep. I want you to brakes. <laughs> what I want you to do is go check that pedal because I honestly think it's going to be a night and day difference for what you had before. What's that one? 516. When did we even do a 516 you know, wrench? I think we just found it. Tell me all about it, G. Tell me about that pedal. Let a guy take a gander for a second. Remember, remember how it was when you drove it here this morning? Beer. There you go. Now, tell me what you think of the pedal. Feels much gooder. Better than much how, when you drove here this morning? The reason, there's not much difference, but the only thing is when we drive it, the old master and the old proportioning valve was a 50-50 split because it was a drum up front, drum back. Do you know what back. this split is? Because I don't I know believe any. You guys can correct me if I'm wrong because that's what the internet always does. 70-30. 70, 30, 70 front, 30 rear. Yeah. But well, some of them are like 
but it depends on like the car. I don't, I don't know. I just bought this kit on the interwebs. Well, it's good for the Bernies. It's good for the Bernies. Yeah, it's seventy thirty. Yeah. All right, so but we're it does going feel to actually deep down in the pedal. I can deep feel down the, better. The the grab better than before, but that's okay. probably because the fronts are actually disc brake. Yeah, now. right. And and those back drums, you can hear them t tighten. They they do. Twist. They tight. Actually, that's a really good thing. I want to I want to see because you were spinning them. Gee, <laughs> can't even turn them. Seriously? Well, you need to loosen these things up a little bit. Good load. Put on the brake. Oh, yeah, that ain't even moving. Hold Cameron said he wanted to air up the air shocks a little bit. He said he put them down because of the fitment. It is a little close. Gee, that's probably the right call. Show me what you're doing here. This is, in this here is for is both the air, air shocks? It's here in an air tank. See, I don't know this stuff. Then, let me... Let's see. Let's see how the... Let's see it go up. Oh, it just did. Let's see. Holy. Where are we sitting? Science. Cameron's nice. like, good enough. It's Let's look at it. It's actually pretty nice. Cameron's like, good enough for the people, Cameron. We're going to start this bad boy up. Let's make sure that battery didn't cause no problems. I think I think we'll be Gucci with the battery. Hold the, the battery? Hold the brake. Don't Come see on. no leaks? See no leaks? See no leaks, feel no leaks. Hear no leaks. Ooh, That's some American muscle right there. She aight. Oh. Test the brakes, do a little. Feel good? How's she feel? Do you need to do the little brakes? Way better than before? A lot same. better than before. A lot yeah. better than before? Okay. First U turn? How's it feel? She feeling alright. This power steering needs to be done though. This is this is ridiculous. Add it to the list. It's like so jerky. Got some fuel lines, power steering pump. Add her to the list. Do we need your fan on? Not yet. We're not even at 180. Yeah, okay. Good. She's home. She's home. home with brakes. Come take a look. Now I got all that good stuff. Look, look at that. This final product. Look at that. It looks amazing. So highly recommend this one. I mean, highly what recommend do you think? it. I separated the kit. So okay. obviously, um, the master cylinder came off of a different site than the proportioning valve. Um, but the proportioning valve, I will actually say, it was a really, really nice kit because okay. it came with these pre bent top lines. That and was the really bracket. nice. These two, these are short lines. I mean, I've done brake lines I've, I've, a, a ton, and doing these small little lines would have sucked. So shout out to them for doing the little lines. Yeah, we'll um, throw that all that stuff in the description. Yep, we'll um, we'll put it in the description. Other than um, that, I mean, today we got battery done and everything. We got, we got battery the valve cover lines. Top the valve cover top. Wow. We got, got it all done. Up top. Did a whole bunch of stuff. So now we'll just you know. No tomorrow. So What's so next? tomorrow, tomorrow, tomorrow's a surprise. We're gonna bring the surprise. We, we're not gonna take the Nova over because the body mounts, that's next on this thing for sure. Yeah. We're gonna do the body mounts, but we're gonna, we finished all that stuff up. We'll take probably the Z or something like that. We'll take my truck, whatever, over to the new surprise for you guys. So stay tuned. Um, see you tomorrow. Yeah, we'll see you tomorrow. Welcome back guys, day two. Uh, we have something to show you. Our number one thing here today, we obviously finished up the Nova yesterday. Uh, fantastic, it's got brake lines, that stuff works a lot better now, actual portioning valves, so it's not, you know, not, it's not, it's, it, what's the best way to put it? 
last the last time we drove it, it didn't stop. <laughs> and now it does stop. So, but either way, we got a little surprise to show you if you guys keep up on Instagram and Facebook. Uh, we have a new project. Welcome to Tetanus Tonka. Tetanus Tonka. Now, I, I know it's not name. yellow, so some of you guys will be all, oh, goodness, but either way, it's Tetanus Tonka. It's a good name. This is a 1967 Ford F100. And uh, either way, this thing is a new pro. Oh, that's new. <laughs> either. <laughs> I tried to take off the gas cap. We're replacing that thing okay. anyway. <laughs> either way, um, I posted this a couple weeks ago, a little blacked out picture and everything, but this is it. We're calling it Tetanus Tonka because, yeah. you know, you have to kind of have your tetanus well, shot to be around it. Tetanus, tetanus, tetanus. Yeah, it's just tetanus everywhere. Either way, we want to run you guys through this thing. Um, this will be something we want to add to the channel as long as you guys, you know, want to see it pretty much. Um, that's the main that? thing is we're going to want to hear from you guys what you guys want to see more of. Obviously, we know you guys like to see the uh, American Muscle stuff. You like seeing the Nova on the channel. And it's not terrible. Like, to be honest, it... <laughs> It needs love. The body, like, like the, this needs to get replaced. But, like, in here, like, yeah, crack dash, we can replace that. These bench seats, you know, we'll get those redone. Up here, Cameron wants to do something special up there. Um, and the reason why. We'll keep I it, oh, and the best special. part about this thing, too. Oh, hold on. Let me get in here. Yeah, buddy. Manual. <laughs> this thing, does it actually, can I try to, like. Yeah. Oh. There's nothing better than that sound right there. Just mechanics. Yep. It's awesome. It's old school stuff too, so you don't have no slave cylinder in these or anything like that. It's just straight metal to metal. And the sound? Clean. 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 I love that. Show the people under the hood quick. The biggest thing with this truck is it's actually uh, my girl's truck, basically. It's going to be built for her. That's why she wants to do some custom stuff with Ooh, the interior and everything. Wee. But yeah, either way, Good. he's got a little Love. frisbee. Play some games while you're working on it because it's going to need it. Um, either way, <laughs> no, though. No, because this truck is going to be playing games with us. <laughs> yeah. So we're giving it a frisbee, frisbee to calm down. Yeah. Uh, yeah, so we had a, there was a tank in here apparently and it was hooked right up to the good old Wootsie collar. And then uh, it would run, but we need to replace that, that gas tank because That's one, right. it's not safe. Like, they are, they're, they're behind not, your it's, seat, it's but safe, in all reality, it, we're just going to throw a tank in the back and run yeah. new lines. The main reason that tank won't work is it's rotted and pitted underneath, and there's too much stuff that's blocking the lines up. It doesn't up. make so, any sense. No reason to sit there and mess with it when we could just buy a new tank yeah, and this swap thing, it I in. mean, underneath here, not bad. In line six. Needs a belt. Uh, it needs more than a belt. <laughs> no, no, it just needs a belt. <laughs> So this actually um, runs and drives really good. We'll obviously fire this up again. He says it runs and drives. No, I've no, never I have, I have seen this proof, thing run and drive. Video proof. <laughs> it was only about a year ago, something like that. A year um, ago. Oh, Not too bad though. Oh, but it sorry, runs and light. drives. It's oh, do you keep knocking I stuff keep over? Keep on knocking the light. Either Give way though, this it. is something that we just want to add to the channel because you guys do like to see the old school cars. Um, we've just you know our the comments say state comments that the say, Z. Comments say they want muscle. Muscle. We give the people the muscle. Yeah. And, and this thing, so I think, Cameron, a rundown of this. Long story, story short, we're going to be leaving the exterior the way it is. Uh, we're going to do some stuff to the interior. Maybe some bumper action here. Yeah, probably. You know, yeah, bumper. Get rid of this. Bumper. The old Clean up the motor a little bit. Probably new Pressure radiator, wash. stuff like that. This truck bed, I would love to make him, Cameron wants to leave it. I would love to do a little something in here to make it like an actual functional truck bed. Um, but we're gonna have to like get all this stuff out of here and assess the situation. Yeah, and as you can see, it's mint. Mint. Either way though, I want to see. Actually, I, I said it last time. When was this thing last registered? Oh four. This is the old school plates too in Wisconsin. Yep. I, if if anyone in uh, Wisconsin watches, those are like back in Nam days. Two thousand four. Is this an intake gasket? Yeah, it is. It is. That's an intake gasket on the back. Oh. Very good. Well, that's for a small block, so we know Holy. that's not for this. Um, either way though. <laughs> Yeah, so it's last registered in 04. It hasn't moved in a long time, but it was sitting, supposedly it was sitting in a field. And uh, we just, you know, we want to take it. We want to do something with it. Bring it back on the road. As you can see, the webs are growing and growing. We want to get those off of there. Yeah, we got to get But either off. way, we want to hear what you guys have to say about it. Um, give us some ideas in the comments and everything like that. Hit us up on Instagram, Facebook, ideas. Send us yours. Send us pictures of yours. Send us ideas, stuff like that. We got V8s we can throw in this. Oh, yeah. We can do anything. We do have, we got, yeah, there is a motor we could put in here. Yep, we got some five liters sitting around. So uh, I don't see. know. We'll find out. You we guys comment. You guys. We want to hear from you guys. Other than that, we're going to wrap it up here. We'll see you guys in the next video.